The Australian actress's stylist has come under fire for choosing an unflattering attire for her to wear to the 2024 Oscars. The 33-year-old Australian actress caused a stir when she chose a shimmering Versace gown with a sloping neckline and odd draping at the hips instead of her signature Barbie pink. Margot accessorized with a matching Fred Layton ring and a two-toned gold cuff. Social media was quickly used by detractors to vent their displeasure with Margot's appearance, denouncing her ensemble as uninspired and out of sync with her voluptuous figure. The carpet belonged to her. One commenter bemoaned, this is, not even renting, while another said, such a boring look. Come on. Another person remarked, this incredibly boring yawn of a dress ended the most epic and stylish fashion streak of all time, alluding to Margot's much-publicized Barbie red carpet trip. I'm so let down. I was anticipating epic, they continued. Margot's hair, left out and groomed with a faint bedhead texture, was targeted by others. One observer remarked, the hair? Crying emoji, while another added, all her gowns are great but she can do better with her hair. I have no idea what her hairstylist's constant thought process is. Margot's Oscars appearance, however, drew a lot of praise from fans online, with one commenting, she looks incredible, as she has this entire award season. One person wrote, well, damn, and included a fire emoji. For his role as Ken, Ryan Gosling was also nominated for Best Supporting Actor, however, Oppenheimer's Robert Downey Jr. won the award. Barbie was not successful in any of the three categories in which she was nominated, Best Adapted Screenplay, Achievement in Production Design, and Achievement in Costume Design. The movie's popular ballad, What Was I Made For?, by Billie Eilish and Phineas O'Connell took home the Best Original Song trophy, but Barbie was the real winner. I'm Just Ken by Ryan Gosling was also nominated in the same category.